This is Chippy from Ultrabook News at the Ultrabook booth IDF 2012. So there's a bunch of Ultrabooks here. Uh, this one stands out for me. It's the lightest Ultrabook there is on the market. Announced at 999 grams and then came to the market at 870 grams. So for those of you from the US who don't know, that's like 1.4 pounds or something ridiculous. 1.8. Okay, 1.8. So under two pounds. Um, it's actually way, way lighter than most netbooks. The netbooks came right down to about 1.1 kilo. This is about 20% uh, lighter than that. So I guess the downside is it's gonna, probably going to have a smaller battery in it than some of the others. Uh, we don't know the exact size of the battery. Let's have a quick look around the device though. Full HDMI, USB 3, USB 2, combo, um, head, oh that's a headphone port there, no, no microphone import. Input full SDXC card there. There's the vents out. Nothing on the back and nothing on the bottom. So you got your sealed battery there. No replaceable battery. Just quickly flipping that open. This is Japanese so model, not available outside Japan. So you got the Japanese uh, keyboard on here. I believe that's a 1600 by 900 screen. Uh, difficult to actually tell this yes, is all in Japanese <laughs> but I think it's a 1600 by 900 screen just getting a feel for the device here this was a this is metal I think it's like magnesium uh, alloy or something here a big bunch of uh, lights at the bottom there mouse pad is a single unit with a click to touch bottom left bottom right actually it clicks most of the way around the pad there not sure quite how useful that is Keyboard, a little bit squishy. There's not a lot of, of course, this is such a thin device, you're not going to get a lot of uh, play on the uh, keys. And there's actually not a huge amount of click, but it would be uh, wrong to actually judge that right now without testing, uh, you know, long term sort of typing on this. It does feel, feel okay typing into the input field there. On the back again, that's a nice metallic finish. Really, really beautiful. Now, this is not a super cheap device, but um, and I believe there's a V Pro version of this, which is uh, extremely expensive. This one's a Core i7, it's the La VZ, available in Japan, 870 grams. It's the lightest Ultrabook there is right now. This is Chibi from Ultrabook News. We're at uh, IDF this week. Don't forget, ultrabooknews.com for more.